Hello again people, Donkey here, and uh, we're looking at another architectural build which I have done. This is in fact a tea room, or a coffee shop. I'll leave it up to your imagination to decide whether it's a tea or a coffee shop. So let's get into it. I have discovered carpenter's blocks, and they are brilliant. I've also discovered Crayfish's furniture mod. It's definitely been a lot of fun using those, and makes my architectural buildings look that extra bit better. What have I done here? Well, I've put in a small kitchen with a stove and it kind of fits in with that small coffee or tea shop. I've put a small counter window there so you can serve the customers. I've also put a cheeky doorbell on the front there. I'm really liking the crayfish mod. It really does add that extra bit of detail to your buildings. You can kind of see what carpenters blocks do. They add curves and uh, slopes to your buildings, which is really good for roofs. We'll definitely be seeing some interesting shapes coming in future builds because I do have some planned. I've built this small bridge down there with a custom tree. That's actually my first custom tree so it went pretty well. I added a small garden behind the tea shop. Maybe they could grow tea leaves in there. I added a small harbour down the hill. I did this because there is a river down here and I thought that maybe a small harbour would look really nice here. The boat is made up of complete carpenter blocks and this allows me to get a really tight small space. The small harbour is carpenter blocks and the things on the side are actually trap doors. I feel like this black trim really makes it pop. Moving on to the bridge, I built this with carpenter's blocks and I think it came out really really well. I kind of went for an old medieval look and that hay roof really makes it look like that. The custom tree is actually one of my first custom trees. And I really like how it looked, so there will be many, many more. I used a few hidden lighting techniques with carpenter's blocks. If you didn't know, light shines through carpenter blocks, so you can kind of hide them under the floor. Overall, I think this tee shot really works well, and it's just a small build which you might want to build on a server or something. More people wanted to know what kind of blocks I was using, so for the walls I was using spruce planks, for the floor I was using birch, and I was using cracked brick for the features. Everything else was either carpenter's blocks or crayfish blocks. I feel like I really captured the small space feel I was going for and it worked out really well. I'm going to leave you with a couple of shots of the whole thing. If you enjoyed I'd appreciate a like and a subscribe and thanks for watching.